Holden's VA Supercar teams have completed their preparations ahead of this weekend's Gulf Air 400 in Bahrain. After last week's opening round in Abu Dhabi, the teams are now on familiar ground. This is the fourth year of the V8 supercars in Bahrain, but the first time the teams will tackle the full 5.41 km Grand Prix circuit. Today, all of the teams, including Team Vodafone and Jamie Winkup, walked the extended layout. Our, our last visit here was great. We, we won all three races. The visit before that, we never finished a race, so it's uh, mixed feelings here at Bahrain, but we'll see what happens. Winkup is in everyone's sights after last weekend, and the three-time Bathurst winner fully aware of those wanting to beat the Holden with number one on the window. So the number one carries a bit of uh, a bit of, a bit of hunting inspiration for uh, for the opposition, but um, hey, we'll, we'll just go out there and do our thing, and if we can qualify well at the front and stay out of trouble, that's um, that's going to be a good weekend. Super Cheap Auto Racing's Russell Ingle has enjoyed strong performances in Bahrain. Yeah, even though they've extended the Bahrain circuit, it is a little bit different. At least three quarters of the circuit is the same well as used to a couple of years ago. And, uh, and we went very well here, so we're really looking forward to it. And last weekend he debuted a brand new 888 race engineering with Holden Commodore. After a weekend in Abu Dhabi where he finished ninth, Ingle is confident that Bahrain will see the true form of the Super Cheap Auto Racing Commodore. We always knew that was going to be the toughest event. From here on, I think it's going to be a lot easier. And uh, at least I know Bahrain. Like I said, I've been on the podium here before as well. So at least I've got my head around the car a little bit better. Uh, a track I know. Well, three quarters of the track I know anyway. And uh, yeah, I think we should. I think we should be okay.